um, this is what really kind of got me reeled in into connecting to who I was, okay? Like I'm talking, my past life as Cleopatra was weird, okay? So um, it was very strange. So I was living on the East Coast um, then. And um, I used to go to this nice little botanica, you know, nice little witch shop. And that was where I started my journey. And so, um, you know, as I was seeing on the little counter, or the, the you know, the little shelves, I saw a uh, Tutankhamun incense. Okay, and so um, I was really drawn to Egypt. I was like, you know, this stuff is it's interesting. You know, um, I don't know, I just feel like, I felt so pulled to grab this incense anyway. And it was like a powdered incense that you burn in a bowl. Okay, you guys know what I'm talking about. And so I bought this Tutankhamun incense. And um, I brought it home. And um, what I like the most is I like to... Um, this is one of the ways to get more prophetic dreams. Is to actually light incense before you go to sleep. Okay, and so um, I lit this incense, okay, this powder, and um, Jesus saw another spirit. Hello to you too. But anyways, I saw a mummy just now. <laughs> the signs, right? The signs. Like I said, you guys, when you work with your gift, you will start seeing stuff naturally, and you'll be okay with it. You get used to it. I get used to it all the time. But um, anyways, um, you made me lose my train of thought. You hear me? Who was just visiting? You made me lose my my train of thought. I think it's King Tut visiting. Hi there, dear. Um, but anyways, I lit this incense. And this man's presence was stronger than ever. I don't remember the conversations that we had. But we had them in my dream. <laughs> I barely remember it. Um, I think it's because it's... I don't know. But I just know that I had a very strong dream of him. Okay, like I said, my throat chakra is blocked. I feel like um, King Tut's higher self can understand what kind of dream he sent to me. So I remember, but I barely remember. And usually I'm not the type... To be like that baby usually in my dreams i do remember but in that one i don't really remember much i mean i remember a little bit like i remember kind of being in in a gold room okay in a gold room and um he was uh he was trying to give something to me and so um ever since i felt very protected um I also had a lot of movement happening in my life um, during that time. But yes, um, and then, yeah, no, it's, it's crazy. I'm telling you guys, um, light some incense before you sleep. You'll never know what kind of dreams you'll achieve, you will receive, achieve, whatever it is. <laughs>